Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, hi, my name is Madison and I post college related videos specifically based around nursing since I'm in nursing school. And today is the first day of my second term of my second semester of nursing school. So basically our nursing school, we have two terms within each semester. So you have 16 weeks, so you have term A, which is eight weeks, and term B, which is eight weeks. So eight plus eight, 16. And they do that so we can get more classes done. So they cram 16 weeks of information into eight weeks. It's crazy. It's a lot. And so starting today, October 19th, I am taking my med surge two class. We call it nursing concepts, but it's a med surge class and my pharmacology two class. So yeah, I just finished my behavioral health psych rotation. That was awesome. And now we have these next eight weeks before Christmas break and I am just praying I get through it. Um, I just got a pumpkin spice latte from Starbucks and I have a lecture today from two to four and it is about 1 15 and I've been up since 9 30 this morning. I made it breakfast and I was just doing like laundry. I was putting away my laundry and just getting kind of organized, situated, showered, got ready. So that's what's going on today and I have a big to-do list here which I will show you guys. This is the ivory paper coat planner. This is my to-do list for today and then I kind of just jotted in the time that I'm at lecture. I do have a zoom meeting for with a company after my lecture so my lecture ends at four i have a zoom meeting with the company at 4 15 which i'm super excited about but anyway cheers to a uh, hopefully great learning experience the next eight weeks okay so for my class i have my lemon water my pumpkin spice latte i have this week one sheet out um it's like the readings and stuff I have a handout that I printed out and then I have these notes that I took on the PowerPoints and there was like articles to read and stuff so I just took notes on that and then I printed them and my printer doesn't print double sided so I manually like flipped it which was kind of a pain but that's okay and then I just have a notebook in case I need to type anything out and then I have a notebook and then I have a notebook under here in case I need to type anything and I plan to write additional notes on here, but like say she talks, she's talking too fast, I can write them in the notebook and then put them on here so it can be like neat. So this can be like a study guide. Obviously my computer are right here and I am just waiting for the Zoom meeting to start. It starts in eight minutes. We wanted to just pop on here and show you guys this new Teamy mask. Because I'm literally obsessed with the Teamy Detox face mask. Like, I barely have any left. I love this. I have been using it for over a year now, I think, and I love it so much. So they're coming out with a new face mask, which is the Beauty Mask Restorative Clay Facial. It has zinc oxide, kaolin clay, I think that's how you say it, I'm not sure, and butterfly pea. So it looks really similar to my favorite face mask, the Detox Mask from them. So this one's obviously green and this one's blue. And see how it smells Ooh, oh my gosh it smells just so like calming so I like to make sure my face is obviously clean and I'm just gonna take some off of here I love the color the blue So, and as always, I have a discount code for you guys for Teamy. It is MMK15 for 15% off, I believe, and MMK25 for 25% off. And I'll put it like right here and also down in the description with links. You guys can definitely go check that out. Okay guys, so my Zoom 
meeting is done. I literally had to pee so bad because I drank all my pumpkin spice latte and then I drank two cups of water. I am going to take a little break from school and edit because I totally just forgot. I have another Zoom meeting in literally three minutes. I'm so glad I remembered. Okay, meeting's done, lecture is done, and I will show you guys kind of my setup right now or what's going on. So these were the notes that I took. A lot of it was just like an intro kind of thing. And then this is what I have. So I don't always take like neat notes. Like this is just like a spill of everything. And I'm just going to kind of add it in here. Um, like where it's neat and I can kind of review and go over what I just learned in lecture. So that is nice. So that's what I'm going to do. But I think first I'm going to get something to eat because I'm hungry, but I don't know what I want. Also last night I was just doing some med practice, um, refreshing for farm two. And it's literally, they were just like worksheets that I had that I, um, redid or like wrote the problems on here and practiced from farm one. So it's nothing like too crazy i know this stuff so i was brushing up on like the conversions and mental analysis and stuff like that so this is my dinner i got some mac and cheese chips and a baguette not very healthy i know but it is what it is and i am going to watch kendall ray's crime october right now so i'm going to watch this it is a 27 minute video while i eat and then i'm going to finish doing school stuff i'm cold so i'm wrapped up in my robe as per usual Okay, so this is, these are my very messy notes, and I just jotted down in here some stuff. There we go, and then we'll pick up the rest of this in lecture tomorrow, so yeah. So everything is laid out for lab. Obviously, I have my jacket, Apple Watch, my water bottle, my backpack, my clothes, socks, leggings, sure, all that. My badge, my mask, my white coat, my blue lab tote bag underneath, and then in my backpack, I have my stethoscope, my stethoscope case, pen light, all that, pencil pouch, planner, my lab binder, and then I'm going to throw in my laptop in the morning and my laptop charger, and pack some breakfast, and we will be good. So I'm going to do some farm PowerPoint readings. I already listened to like my lectures and stuff the other day, but I want to go through and read the PowerPoints one more time. So I'm ready for stuff on Wednesday. And then I'm just filled up my lemon water and I'm going to eat a granola bar for like my dinner. Sorry, Xander's screaming. So yeah, because I kind of ate Panera like a late or early dinner. So yeah, but that is that. And I'm so tired. So tired. So I'm gonna try to go to bed by nine, but yeah, I have to be up. I have lab at 10 a.m. Good morning. It's 8.45. Oh my gosh. I can barely open my eyes. It's 8.45. Oh, it's gonna be a good day. 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 Hey, we are ready. I was gonna do a bun, but doing a low pony instead. Bed is made. Who are we? I don't know. And I have all my stuff. I look like a pack mule. I can't even see as per usual. Water and let's go. My teeth feel so straight and shiny because I want my retainer. Yes, here we go. Here we go. I'm so tired. All right, so I'm on my way. It's 9.09, class starts at 10, but I wanted to get there early. It's a little bit far away. And I also want to get some breakfast from somewhere, maybe, probably. My hair looks great. Anyway, yeah. I got these cute hoop earrings from Amazon. I'll put them down below. I got them on Amazon Prime Day. Very cute. So, yep, it's so like gross and cloudy out. I hate hate when it's cloudy. I wish the sun was out. What? I'm at school. Okay, so I'm at school. It's really green now. I got Burger King. Burger King breakfast is so good. Their French toast sticks and hash browns. McDonald's hash browns are better, but anyway. And then I went to McDonald's and I got a coffee and I poured it in here. Cute. 
Yuck! I'm gonna spill my syrup all over me. Um, yeah, hopefully this is good. I've never been to this Burger King before. It is 9.37. And they want us to be here at 9.55. So, I'm doing good. Mmm, very good. I like when they're a little crispy and not, like, undercooked. I have no idea where I'm going, like, in the building. So, this should be interesting. But we're not going to worry about it. We're really not. Because it's not the end of the world. I'm so tired. Oh, I'm all right, you guys, so I'm home from lab. It is 12.45, so I have lecture in 15 minutes from one to two. So lab went so well, I'm gonna quickly set up for lecture and then I will tell you guys how it went after lecture. Guys, the tiredness is hitting me. It's 2.48, I got done with got done with lecture at two and I've just been trying to like get organized and whatnot and now I'm gonna type my paper I have to type in my bed. It's really risky because I'm tired, but lab went so well. It was so fun. So there were these like mannequins that like have pulses and they blink and their eyes dilate and it's just so crazy. Um, and there was a little baby one that we got to assess. It was so fun. And then we like worked on like S bar and stuff. We went around we had five patients and then we presented our S bar to the class and our instructors and then we had a scenario where we had to go in and our instructor was the patient and we had to kind of practice our therapeutic communication skills with them and stuff like that and now we have to do like a reflection on how we think we did during those scenarios and what we could have done better what we want to do next time and what we think was like good that we did I guess so it was super fun and that's what I'm gonna do it's due Monday at 11 59 and today is Tuesday so it's due in a week but I'm getting it done because it's fresh in my mind and I have a lot of other stuff going on too so yeah did I take a nap yes am I ashamed no because I needed it but anyway it is like eight something right now I ate dinner took a bath and now I am back to work. Before I did fall asleep though, I did type a paper that I needed to type. So that's good. Um, so yeah, I just have everything here. I get this cool phone like stand holder off Amazon. I'll link it below. It's very fancy. So <sighs> yes. Okay, so everything is laid out for tomorrow. So it's 11.06. I finished watching one of the pre-recorded lectures that she posted today and we also have like live ones too but after we run out of time she has like other recorded ones she sends to us and then yeah so tomorrow I have training at the hospital that I work at as a PCNA and it's just like training I've never done it before um I think it's like after you've worked there for uh, so long you have to like get um like get checked off and like skills again kind of like how your CPR you have to get like recertified something like that um so I have like training right after a lab for farm tomorrow so hopefully that goes well but I'm just going to do some readings in bed and just kind of um add anything else to my paper that I need to submit so that can be done it's due Monday night at 11 59 but I want to get it done because I don't want to worry about it I look crazy because this is literally I just literally feel crazy and I look crazy, so. Okay, it's like 7.40 a.m. I'm running late. This is my outfit. I'm training after, so. Yes, I'm very tired. My hair looks ridiculous, but these with these stuff, and here we go. So it's 9.53 right now. My training's at 10.30. Our lab went really well. We went over intradermal 
intramuscular and sub Q injections and we got to practice and I feel like such a dummy sometimes. Um, I was trying to <laughs> put the needle into the vial when the stupid cap was on it and the teacher told me she's like, it's okay, we just all haven't had enough coffee this morning. I'm like, yeah, that's it. Um, so yeah, but hey, we all gotta start somewhere and some of us further down than others like me, so. Yeah, my instructor is so nice. And that's what I wanted to mention. Like I've gotten so lucky. Like, so tomorrow's my like last first of the week or whatever. Like I have my first clinical this week. So I have to meet my clinical instructor, but all my instructors are so nice. A couple of them I've had before are like I know, and then a couple of them are new. They're so nice. Like the ones I already had are nice. So I knew that they were really nice. It just makes me really happy. Bag secured. Look who it is! Park so hot. I know, we're trying to find where I parked at. Alright, it only took me literally like 10 minutes to find my car, but I found it and training's done, so... Okay, so this is my little messy desk area. So I just had lecture for farm. She gave us, we have like, we had two hours of like pre-recorded lecture for this week that she shared, and then we did like an hour like webex lecture but there is only like 10 of us on like i don't know where the rest of the class is maybe when they hear it's not mandatory people don't show up i'm not sure but it helped a lot just like reiterate all the information stuff we learned in lab today as well so i'm gonna run to the grocery store quickly it is 4 p.m 4 3 p.m i'm gonna run to the grocery store to get some stuff for my clinical lunch tomorrow plus i just need some like stuff to snack on while like i'm studying and stuff like that so it's 6 15 p.m i have just been kind of getting organized as per usual i feel like it's like a constant thing so this is today but this was yesterday so definitely my to-dos are getting a lot longer compared to i don't know like before so yeah crazy and i just planned out um like my week at a glance for next week just because i kind of have a lot going on so i planned this out here so that's the idea of like an assignment for ATI I do, but um, I wrote this the other day and I didn't feel like writing it on my planner yet. So it's still on the sticky note, but that's that. We are right here and now I'm just like looking up different terms that were used in our lab and that I just kind of want to go over. So um, just different things knowing about like a lipid profile, an angiogram, A1C. And those are terms and stuff that they used casually that I know will definitely come up. And instead of being down on yourself and being like, oh my gosh, like, why don't I know this? I wrote the words down. There was um, about five or six and I'm going to look them up. I meant to do it yesterday, but I put it in my to-do list for today. So it gets done and now you know, you know, so next time it's brought up, you're like, oh yeah, I remember that because chances are if they bring it up once like stuff like this like your a1c your lipid profile stuff like that it is going to be important and it's going to come up again and again and again i'm sure so i'm gonna look it up so i know it now and after this after i look this up i am actually in the process of writing my grandpa a thank you letter and i'm going to mail to his house and then i also am going to do some i have like a packet of like 13 pages i think of like practice syringe problems it's not like required, but I've been doing a lot of practice problems and a lot of, or a lot of dimensional analysis practice problems. So I'm gonna do some syringe practice problems after. So as you saw, I packed my lunch. I ate some dinner. Um, I just had, I made like a little bagel and then I also had just some leftovers. So I had mashed potatoes, broccoli and a bagel and then some crackers and hummus. So very lovely dinner. Um, <laughs> and then over here as per usual, I have everything set up. We have my clinical bag. I have a what's in my clinical bag video. So I will link that down below if you haven't seen it. And that was from Last fall, my first semester, it stayed the same. Um, so yeah, except I just have like different paperwork in a folder instead of a binder. And then I have my coat, even though it's supposed to be like almost 80 tomorrow, but I'm gonna bring it because it'll probably be cold at 6 a.m. I have my scrub pants underneath, scrub jacket, scrub top. I have my badge underneath that paper. I just have like directions, um, gum, 
my shoes and that bag and compression socks. And now I'm going to sit in my bed. I want to use this. I'm going to use my weighted sleep mask tonight. But yeah, so I'm just going to kind of cross things off in my planner, see if I need to add anything for tomorrow, and watch um, an insulin video that my teacher posted. And I was doing just these like problems here on syringes, but they don't give us an answer key. So I'm gonna see if she can send it to us so we can see like if we're doing it right. So yeah. And then I'm gonna watch Unsolved Mysteries. I think that's what it's called on Netflix because I started one episode, but I like fell asleep through it last night. So yeah, this is season two. I'm so excited because I really like season one. I didn't watch all of them. I don't think I watched one about like aliens, but um, yeah. So it's 6.15, I left at like 5.55ish. I wanted to get a coffee, so I did, and I just poured it in here. Much needed. I never even thought caffeine affected me, but, like, maybe it does. Maybe I think it's just, like, a mental thing, actually. I think maybe it'll affect me or help me, but I don't know. This McDonald's coffee just tastes so good. Nice coffee, cream, and sugar, if they make it right. Today, it's not really made that right, um, but it's still, good. it's still good. I'm learning to like it. <laughs> And yeah, I also got a hash brown. I've never really even been a McDonald's person, but since I tried their coffee, like I like their breakfast, but yeah. Okay, so clinical starts in 15. I finally found the employee parking lot. So, so yeah, that is, that is that. And I'm so sleepy. Ugh. I just, again, like I feel like I, I feel like I've mentioned this before, like whenever I have clinical, like I can't sleep because I'm afraid I'll oversleep and I think I'm just like anxious and stressed, but yeah, my eyes are like swollen shut, so hopefully today's a good day and it will be. So I'm done with clinical, it's 2.07, the sun's out, it's hot out, thank goodness. I know I have my stethoscope still on, I'm about to take it off, I always get comments, so yeah, it's really hot as you can tell. I'm like so, ew, I'm so greasy from my mask or like oily, that's so gross. But it went well, I will tuck to guys when I get home. All right guys, so we have this little mess here and this is my Foley kit. And um, we have to film ourselves in lab. We checked off on male and female insertions and removal and like sterile urine specimen, whatever, all of that in semester one and so they want to make sure that we're remembering how to do the skills and maintaining sterile fields and all of that so i'm going to the lab tomorrow for an hour to film myself i don't think it'll take an hour actually i know it won't take an hour but um depending on how much i remember i'm trying to brush up on my skills right now make sure i have all of my supplies in here and i'm gonna watch some videos on it and go over my notes and stuff like that on it um, and it's, this is due, I believe week four, this is due or week three or something. And it's week one, but I'm getting it done and submitting it. So I don't have to worry about it. And then we have to type a paper on it as well. And, um, yeah, so this is going to be my, I have to type a paper today from clinical. So I'm going to be typing three papers in one week, which is crazy, but they're not hard. So I'm not complaining. It's better than like a research paper. I hate those. So that's that. And, um, yeah, it is. 8 30 p.m. I had dinner with my mom and my sister so that was nice and just I'm relaxing now doing this finishing up clinical paperwork because I have to submit that by Sunday night so I want to get all of it done today um we didn't really have much today because it's orientation but then it starts getting pretty crazy next week <laughs> guys so it is friday and it's 8 40 a.m i have a doctor's appointment at nine and then i 
like I was talking last night about the Foley, I am going to open the lab to film myself today. I took a slot from 10 to 11. Um, I don't think it'll take me that long, but yeah, so that's that. I also need to pick up like a prescription and yeah, so that's what we're doing this morning and I finally get to see Antonio. I haven't seen him. I saw him at work for a second, but that wasn't even like planned and so I'm excited because it's been a week and normally we hang out like every day, but I told him I was like, these next eight weeks, like you need to be on top of my stuff because he makes me want to just give him all the attention in the world. So yeah, but he's good at like multitasking. I'm not. Okay, so I just filmed my check off. I'm sweating in here. I think it was because I was nervous. <laughs> Even though I'm filming it. So now I'm just kind of putting all my stuff away. And that it is. 1038 so it took me about 40 minutes um just because I had to refill a couple times so I'm done with filming and it's so nice out it's hot in my car it's like a summer day it's like so pretty out so it is saturday afternoon my hair is crazy and me and antonio got coffee and i got a bagel this morning he made his own and now we are studying i just submitted my foley video like taping i submitted my foley paper like the rubric i needed to and then last night i submitted my clinical like paper i had to type and Antonio updated his apartment, so he's gonna show you guys because it looks awesome. So, over to you. <laughs> All right, so this is the new corner. So, I got a shoe rack now. So I got that from Lowe's, and then everything on top is from like Five Below Marshalls. And then like I hung those string lights and like taped underneath. And then I just moved that picture around. I got that light from Target. And then this is from Five Below too, like that fountain. So it's kind of cool. It was only like $5 and like that's from Target. And then I got this big mirror now, which I think Maddie told me that mirrors make the place like bigger, so. Oh, is that from HomeSense? Yeah, this is from HomeSense. It was like, huge. it was like $80. Yeah, I feel like the camera really doesn't do it just, like it's really big, but yeah, so I did this little corner. So next I got some more stuff to do, but we see excuse the water on my shirt but i'm getting my hair dyed for the first time in like five years so this is what it looks like before and i'm getting all those dead ends cut off because it's just kind of dry and yeah so this is what it looks like <laughs> So my hair looks really crazy because it's been in a bun so it's kind of like kinked <laughs> really kinked actually but this is my hair it's obviously darker and shorter i got about 10 inches off i can let, i'll put like a picture but it's kind of like literally like all like bent but yeah i like it um let me know if you guys like it or not um yeah, I love it. My hair is super soft. So it is Halloween, so happy Halloween. I hope you guys are all staying safe and having fun. So this video is going up tomorrow, so November 1st. So I hope you guys have an amazing, happy, successful, and blessed November. But I just wanted to quickly update you guys. Since this was my first week and now I'm starting my third week, I have my first farm exam on Wednesday this week and my first farm checkoff, which is injections on intradermal, intramuscular, sub q so like insulin heparin tb tests you know vaccines stuff like that i don't think i'm forgetting anything and yeah so that's that and then next week week four i have my first concepts exam which i'm so nervous about but i did have my first concepts quiz this past monday i think yeah and i got a 9 out of 10 so i wasn't too bummed about that i was proud of myself and 
there was multiple choice select all that apply and like short answers i was really scared but it ended up being fine so i really wanted to show you guys like the study guide i made and what i've been doing and i can do like an updated whole video and stuff on this once i finish this semester but i just wanted to show you guys now because i thought you'd be interested anything she says like on our zoom lectures i type it in red so I just have different colors and each different color is like a different section. So I have like asthma and then we have purples all like the influenza. And then we get into the heart, which is pink. And then I inserted like some pictures and charts and stuff like that. And there's like sometimes a lot of red when she like goes through certain systems. So that's what I have. And I've um, added like pictures as well. And so that is that. This is 19 pages. So this is for week three and my exam is on, I know this is for, this was everything we learned week two. So my exam is on week two and week three. So my week two stuff was all on like just going over chronic and acute pain and how people cope with that. We are going over COPD, asthma, influenza, congestive heart failure, um, coronary artery disease, a bunch of stuff. I feel like I'm forgetting stuff. And then this upcoming week, we're going over um, like seizures, intracranial pressure. Um, I feel like I'm forgetting something, numerous things forgetting, but yeah, so that's what our exam is going to be on. But I hope you guys are all doing well. I love you guys so much. We're so close to 60,000 subscribers, which is crazy. So if you're not already, make sure you subscribe, tell your friends to subscribe, and don't forget to follow me on my social medias. I'll put them down below. And don't forget to check out Teamy. I'm obsessed with their skincare products, and, and there's a discount code so you guys save money. So I love you so much. Let me know how you guys are doing, and I'll see you in my next video.